At Oxford, I met a group of guys who I hung out with who called themselves the Oxford Dangerous Sport Club. And they were dedicated to trying to create new sport, and their definition of sport was really an uncertain outcome. We were at a party, and I was talking about a climbing trip to Erie and Jaya, New Guinea. And at the party, the leader of the Oxford Dangerous Sport Club, David Kirk, said, Jeffrey, you're going to New Guinea. You must try vine jumping. And he was referring to a puberty ritual where the young natives would tie springy vines on their ankles and dive headfirst off of platforms. He actually was a little bit wrong in that the vine jumping was done on the island of Vanuatu, not in New Guinea. But over the course of an evening, we came up with the concept of urbanizing New Guinea vine jumping. One of the people in the Oxford Dangerous Sport Club, Simon Keeling's brother, was in the Royal Air Force. So we went out to the Air Force Base and permanently borrowed the long elastic cords that are used to catch the jets on aircraft carriers with the tail hook, and they were made by the Bungie Corporation. I actually knew that the safety of the harness and the way I had people secured would be safe. But I wasn't really sure about the cord. We didn't do any testing because that would have taken the sport out of it. It's quite a rush to free fall several hundred feet. And then there's a fantastic sensation because you slow really slowly. And then it's almost like being in a Wile E. Coyote Roadrunner cartoon. You just come to a stop and then boom, you get catapulted upwards and you're free falling upwards. And it's, it's actually a very cool sensation. It got a bit of publicity and we ended up jumping from the world's highest suspension bridge on the TV show That's Incredible. And for a season, they had as the opening segment, me in a white tuxedo diving off the uh, Royal Gorge Bridge. For a while, when I met people outside of my sphere, I was actually best known for being one of the guys who came up with the idea and then did the first bungee jump. If there are a few thousand people who go, wee, because of me, I'm very proud. <laughs>